Filmora vs CapCut, the two biggest names in video editing right now, but which one is actually better in 2025? Let's put them head to head and find out. Both editors come packed with powerful features, CapCut brings real light, letting you create studio quality lighting without expensive gear, auto reframe, which instantly turns horizontal videos into vertical for different platforms, and the AI captions that generate subtitles automatically. Meanwhile, Filmora steps up with AI music to generate unique, royalty-free soundtracks for your videos, smart short clips to speed up content creation, and planar tracking, which lets you track and replace flat surfaces in your video with ease. These software offer a lot of cool tools, but how well do they actually perform? I use both of these editors for my own videos, but today we are putting their tools to the test. Which one actually delivers the best editing experience? It's time to find out. CapCut is available on mobile, desktop and even online, so you can edit from anywhere without downloading software. Filmora is on mobile and desktop too, but if you try to use it online, it just tells you to download the PC version. So, Kapka takes the first point, but availability is just the start. What really matters is how easy it is to use, so let's check out interface and user experience. CapCut's interface is clear, modern and easy to navigate, especially for beginners. Everything is laid out simply, making it quick to trim clips, add effects and edit without confusion. Filmora also has a user-friendly interface, but it takes things a step further with features like Filmora Copilot, a smart editing assistant that helps speed up the editing process. Plus, the search function in every tab makes it super easy to find the right stickers, transitions or text effects without digging through menus. So, this time Filmora takes the point. But speaking of smart editing, let's see which one offers more powerful AI tools. CapCut has some impressive AI tools, like Relight, which transforms ordinary clips into studio lit scenes, it also enhances video quality to Ultra HD, turns long videos into short clips and more. But Filmora offers even more AI-powered features that make editing smarter and easier. Smart background music generation automatically creates the perfect soundtrack for your video. Planar tracking lets you replace flat surfaces with a new video that stays perfectly aligned. Plus, the AI object remover makes erasing unwanted objects effortless. And that's just a few of its powerful tools. So, Filmora gets the point again. Now, let's move on to the keyframe animations, which software gives you more control over motion and effects. Both CapCut and Filmora give you solid access to keyframe animations, but CapCut really stand out by offering a wide range of presets, like ease, quad out, and more interesting options that make animation smoother and more dynamic. So, Kapka takes the point here. Now let's talk about something that can save you a ton of editing time. Auto Captions Both editors do a fantastic job when it comes to auto captions, Filmora offers some great templates, however, Kapka stand out with wider variety of templates and customization options to really make your captions pop. So, Kapka takes the point here. Now let's dive in into AI Background Removal, which editor gives you more options and better results for effortless removing background. CapCut offers super fast and efficient auto background removal, making it easy to remove background in seconds. Plus, it has custom removal for more precise edits, so you're covered in any scenario. On the other hand, Filmora shines with its AI portrait cutout, which not only removes backgrounds, but also adds cool effects and offers more customization options. With its smart cutout feature, you get even more precise edits, allowing for more control. While CapCut's Chroma Kit does a solid job, Filmora's chroma key is more refined and gives smoother, more professional results. So, Filmora gets the point. Now let's jump into templates, the perfect way to speed up your editing and make your videos look awesome with minimal effort. While on CapCut in my region, I can only access templates on the web version, which can be a bit inconvenient if I want to edit on my phone or desktop. But with Filmora, templates are available on both the desktop and mobile versions and they're fully customizable. This gives you the freedom to create professional quality videos quickly, no matter where you are. So, Filmora gets the point. Now, let's move on to something that really sets the vibe. Music and sound effects. Which editor has the better library to bring your videos to life? CapCut offers a good audio library filled with music and sound effects across various categories, making it easy to add sounds to your video. But Filmora takes things to the next level with the AI Music Generator, which creates unique tracks that you can customize to fit your style. 
It also features AI sound effects. Just describe the sound you want, set the duration and number of effects, hit generate, and you'll get a completely unique sound effects in seconds. Another standout feature in Filmora is Audio Stretch, which automatically adjusts music to perfectly match your video's length. So Filmora gets the point. Now let's talk about something every editor cares about. Exporting speed. Which one gets your video ready faster? I tested exporting the same 4K clips on both editors to see which one processes videos faster. While both did a good job, CapCut was noticeably quicker at getting the final file ready. So, where it comes to exporting speed, CapCut takes the point. And that's it. Filmora takes the crown this time. I'll definitely keep using both of these amazing editors and I'm really excited to see what new features they'll roll out in the future. It will be interesting to see which one keeps improving and offers the best editing experience. If you want to try Filmora for yourself, check out the link in the description below. Also, don't forget to check out my other videos like how to make animated videos with Filmora or how to get free editing packs for CapCut. Thanks for watching and be sure to like, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.